guys hi so today i am hi i'm here <laughs> today we have created a fairy and an elf and of course i was all over the place but and i know that you are here for my paper crafting but sometimes i'm creating things like this <laughs> so yeah let's see how i made them hi guys welcome and welcome back well i know that you are my followers because of my junk journaling but from time to time i like to make jewelry and to play with um stones and beads and make funny stuff so let's goof around a little bit today, just for fun. <laughs> and I was looking into my um, into my box with these are mother of pearls. This is some kind of shell pressed, and I don't really like these barrels. I don't. And this is rose quartz. Or at least they say that it is. If they have lied to me, well then, it is what it is. And I'm having here a small... Uh, but I'm not going to use this one. I'm going to make another one. <laughs> Let's make a... Because, you know, I was looking in, the, in, the, in this box and I saw these two uh, Mother of Pearls and... They look like, they look like feet to me, like, you see, but I don't like, I don't necessarily like where this uh, hole is. So maybe let's see if we find another leg, <laughs> another shoe. This one looks like a shoe, but not quite. Let's see, can we find another shoe? So yeah, how have you been guys? I have to admit that after the Junk Journal January, when I was like every day, every day filming, day by day, day by day, and I was having those uh, prompts, you know, um after 31 days it is pretty easy to get used to being told what to do and uh, they say that 21 days are enough to create a habit and i really wanted to create the habit of filming every day but i have developed also the habit of being told what to do so now i'm having two legs and i like this one better than this one <laughs> oh yeah <clears throat> and i am not sure that i like this um habit of being told what to do Do we have two shoes? Yeah, we do. And yeah, I'm having a hard time the connecting with myself so in what is considered junk journaling so this is why you are not going to see me junk journaling today I am going to try to reconnect to myself through jewelry making and this is actually what I did for the last days I made some jewelry and I don't know if I have something around to show you. Yes, I do. 
for example, I have created these earrings just I just beaded some Jasper, this is Jasper, yes, and the wire is copper wire. I love working with copper, and I'm having copper in here. Look, but this one has silver, is silver plated, and the copper and the silver they are having some qualities, some qualities to them, yes. Let's and this is also copper and it has silver on it. And I would like to take a hey, 15 centimeters, maybe, maybe 20. No, 15, 15 centimeters. I will take 15 centimeters. Can you see? Can you can? I'm going to take 15 centimeters and I will tear it, cut it. You see, I'm still having the junk journaling uh, vocabulary, T tearing it. <laughs> I'm tearing this wire. <laughs> now I'm cutting it. Okay, so these are the legs, but now we need a belly, we need a head, and we need some hands. So let's see. I'm having this in here. And I'm going to, I will go with this hat because we are um, close to the, um, how is it called? Spring, it is called spring, so yeah. Are we going to make an angel? Let's try. Let's try to make an angel. And it is going to be, I don't know, a color. And I would, I would go with white, but I don't know. Maybe it is going to be blue or purple. Purple. It is going to be purple. So I have folded them in half. I am under no circumstance a jewelry maker. So do not... Consider this a tutorial. This is just a and I am I'm having difficulties considering myself an artist, but I'm a crafter, okay? So let's let's consider this a journey of a crafter to herself. This is a journey to myself, and I'm going to I'm going to make this, you know, this thing here because I want them to stay together like this and we are going to have two hands like this and two legs. Yes, and I'm having in here some beads and let's see what kind of an angel is this going to be. Do we want this belly? Let me let me see if I like this belly. This is a plastic, but it is very old. It is, um, I think it has a hundred years. <laughs> Do I like this belly and these shoes? And the shoes they are going to be glued. Yeah. Yes, maybe I do like this belly. Okay, now we have we need a head. But we said that oh wait. I said that um we are going to celebrate the spring and this belly is not springy at all. So let's find some green. Let's find a green belly. <laughs> and we do have we do have green bellies. Look, this would be a nice belly. This would be a very nice belly, and yes, and we are going to have, these are plastic, these are plastic beads, yes, and in here I'm having some, I think this is gonna be, okay. 
So here I am unprepared again because when you when you start the journey back to yourself you are not ready you are not ready and you don't need to be ready you just you just go oh and this would be this would be a really nice do I want a green belly or do I want a orange belly or do I want do I want this belly do I want we are going to make more <laughs> okay so this is already wired I have changed my mind as you saw I have changed my mind yes 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 these are wired and I will have to take them out of the wire out of this wire and make this angel I like it like this. Okay. Okay. Let's let's destroy. <laughs> okay. So when you and don't be worried don't don't be worried to destroy. Okay? In order to find yourself you will have to destroy whatever you have become. And wherever you have arrived you know and this is this is going to be our belly I'm going to keep these in here and I am going to try to see if this head fits in here and I would like a I would like a different head let me let me check. I would like to have a different head. But these are not big enough. These are not big enough. And this head is too small. Where's my hat? I found, found it. I need a little bit bigger, a bigger, a bigger head. Let me see if I can find a bigger head. These are stones. And do I want to combine stones with... And this is ready to... This is ready to be worn. But I think I'm going to... Anyway, I am all over the place today. I am. I am all over the place. Let me see. Let me see if I can find a bigger head in this box of things. Is this bigger? Is it bigger? It is not bigger. Do, do you like to watch into other people? I mean, <clears throat> this is something that I have created, but yeah, it's a, it's a something to wear. Uh, um, it's a pendant, yes. And I don't know if I will like it, I will leave it as is, or if I add things around. Yeah, these are my projects. I have started them and I have never finished them. So, maybe for this belly we are going to have a bigger green head like this one. Let's see how this fits. This fits perfectly and it is gonna be green and orange and with wings yes and it is going to have white legs let's do this <laughs> let's do this okay so now 
Now, what I need to do is find the bead to put in there as a as a something. Is this is what I was searching for? Found it. Found it. Yes, and I would need a small bead, not a big bead, but a small bead, 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 something like that. And let's see if if, if it fits. No, it doesn't fit. Yeah, never mind. We are going to put the hat on directly. And in here you can see my um, perfect. Perfect. Okay. And now we are going to put the head on. And these are my favorite creations, to be honest with you. And now I'm going to split the hands like that. And I think I have, I think I have created some more. And, oh, the wings. Sorry. Sorry, I forgot the wings. The wings of this uh, spring angel. Yes, it's a, it's a spring angel. I mean... It is already beautiful without the hands. And I don't think that I don't know. Should I should I leave it? I think this one it is going to be a different one. Without hands. Never mind. It is going to have hands and it is going to have a belly. No, it is going to have a dress, some sort of a dress. Let's see what kind of dress we are going to give it a dress. Let's see. There you go, and we have these two little feet and these two hands, and the hands are going to be beaded. And yes, we haven't made the angel. The hands are going to be beaded, and the feet are going to be. Maybe we put them this kind of feet. What do you think? Should we give it this kind of shape? And the angel, angel is going to be completely different. Oh, found one. <laughs> These are pretty big. This is big. And I will need another one. Oh, let me see. Let me check. Let me check really quick. If I can give it this kind of this kind of fit, you know, like like that. There you go. One foot, and can we find a different one like that? Another one. A one and a two. Let's see. Let's see what we can find. This is too big. Too big of a foot. <laughs> yeah. So these are they say that they are um crackle agate, but I don't really know. These are going to be the feet. 
I have decided it is a it is a it is going to be a strange it is going to have only the feet and the 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 hands are going to be and this is some glue and I'm going to put some glue it's E6000 it's an epoxy glue wait 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 a second before I do that I would like to give it a to put a bead in there under the belly like something around these lines but I don't know if this is gonna no it doesn't fit because this is a pretty thick wire and the beads are having smaller can we can I no I cannot okay so let's try it this way too yes this one seems to work like that you know so that it has a little bit of pants And now I'm going to give it some glue <coughs> and I'm going to put a bit of glue in here like that on this leg. That is not a little bit of glue, that is a lot of glue. And I'm going to stick this down in here like that. Okay, and then a bit of glue on this leg. And this is a plastic, plasticky glue. And then when it dries, it dries and it keeps the wire glued to the bead and this is all that I want to have the wire glued to, 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 to the bead and maybe I'll give it a little bit of glue in there also there you have it we are having feet we are having feet okay and now we need hands we need hands and what color should these hands be they should be a many colors they should be many colors yes and i'll take a little bit of beads and put them here like that and i'm not going to think about it i'm just gonna beat them Yes, on to the hands and some beads want to be beaded and others don't want to. So I'm gonna bead whoever wants to be bead, beaded and for the moment only the greens and the blues have come to be beaded but we are going to find other colors for sure. and build them look at them running away running away from me yes and this is i'm creating these because on the first of march i have said it before but i feel the need to repeat myself uh, on the 1st of March, we are celebrating the coming of the spring and in Romania. And we have this custom to give um, 
I think this hand is long enough. Okay, so I'm going to cut. We are making um, small gifts, um, small dangles, um, mostly with red and white. White. Do you know that um, twine that you use um, for Christmas with red and white? We are not using that for Christmas. We are using it for the 1st of March. And we are, um, that is called Marty Shore. And we dangle that twine on some um, charms. Yes, this is the name, charms. Okay, so we are making charms and we gift them and so that um, the one who receives the charm will have a nice uh, prosperous and thriving year and we are celebrating this The, the coming of the spring and the white and the red um, are signifying um, um, reborn, the, the sun being reborn. Yes, this is the, uh, and the white is the snow, of course, and red is the blood. And yeah, for the first nine days of March, we have this story of. Uh, Baba Dokia, uh, Do Dokia, the old lady, and she was an old lady who went to find her sons. One was white and one was red, of course. The white and red is the symbol for uh, twins, primordial twins, yes. And she went to find her, her uh, sons. And she had a lot of um, clothes on, nine of them. And while she was walking, she kept taking off a cloth out, out because she felt warm and warmer and warmer. So, yeah, this is the story of Baba Dokia. And if you want to, you can search for it. And if you don't find it in English, let me know and I will translate it for you. I will find it and translate it. And of course, uh, depending on um, which part of Romania you are searching, you are going to find different um, How are they called? Versions. Yes. So these are the legs and I don't like how they stay in here. So I'm going to put a little bit more glue on the sole of, of its feet. So that it can stay glued. But my glue is a little bit in the dry side. And it is going to hang um, like this <laughs> for a while, somewhere in a drawer. And by the end of this video, I'm going to show it to you. This spring. Okay. And now I'm going to put these beads away and I will I will create this other one. And this one is not going to have um uh, hands or feet or anything. It is going to be simple like and now I have to take these and put them back their place okay do we have a head do we have a 
Do we have a head for this? I will use this head. Like that. Okay. And I am going to use a 28 gauge, I think it is. It's a one millimeter um, thick wire and I'm going to take it like this and cut it. This is really thick. It is a thick wire and it is also uh, copper and um I was negotiating with myself if I want to how I want to look the this but I wanted to look it like this and now because I'm having a little bit too much wire here I'm going to cut it and I'm going to give it an almost perfect Okay, it is copper with uh, uh, silver plated, silver plated copper. This is what it is. Okay, so let's put this head and see if it fits. It does. Do I like it like that? Not necessarily, but. Okay, and now I am going to put the belly like that, and there you have it, a, an angel, a nice angel, yes, and I will put a white bead in here, hopefully I can find one, a white bead that fits this, or a transparent one, let's see. Does it? Yes. Like that. And these are pretty big, but you can you can wear them. Okay, so I'm going to cut it. There. I'm using my finger as a measurement. Let's hope that we can create a loop, a perfect loop in here also. Let's see. How perfect is that? It is not as perfect as the other one, but I can trim a little bit this nose here. There you go. And then There you have it, an angel, a spring angel, yes, and I will have to close this. Like so, it is closed now. Now I have created a spring angel, what can you do with this? I don't know, you can wear it as a pendant. Yeah, you could. You could wear it. Yes. Let's see what else. Do you want to create something with these with these shoes? I would really love to create something with those shoes, but these are too fair too thin, too thin. Is this a little bit uh, no I will take no oh no this is not twenty eight this is eighteen eighteen gauge 18 gauge wire this is 28 the higher the gauge the thinner the wire okay i will try to remember that 
I will try to remember that. Okay, so I am running out of wires. Oh yeah. I am having the copper in here. This is um this is oh, oh 04 and oh 05 millimeters. Should I make it with and this is 0.8 millimeters and should I make it with with copper? Yes, I will make it with copper. I will. And I will take 20 centimeters wire. Why? Because I have plenty of copper wire and I can afford to play a little bit with this one. Twenty centimeters and another twenty centimeters. So yeah, I hope you have a nice Sunday. And for me, it's a bleak day. <laughs> it is a bleak day. And they are roughly, roughly. Equal, but they are not quite equal. <laughs> Sometimes I wish I wasn't so intense and so serious. I wish I was a little bit more happy, happy, joy, joy. But mm, some days are, some days are, you know, what you have seen me doing was playing a little bit with the wires and warming them because when they are warm you can work a little bit better with them they are a little bit more playful more playful yes yes and let's see if this if this fairy wants to come to life <laughs> you are playful already, huh? Yeah, yeah, playful. Playful. Look at you. Look at you. Look what have you done? No. What what? What has happened in here? What has happened in here? You just you played. Yes, you did. You did play. And now we are having a very what is this <laughs> it is playful al already okay cool and now what colors do you want what colors do you want Mm. Do you want this belly? Do you, do you want this belly? Let me check. And these legs. Yeah, why not? We will use that belly. Okay. And the head. We need a head. We need a big head. This is... I don't know if it is really a stone, but it sounds like a stone. And I don't have... Yes, I do have glass. I do have some glass in here. And as you can... Here, it, it is... It, it seems to be... No, it's a plastic. It's a plastic. I checked with my teeth. Plastic. And would you like to have what kind of head? This is too big. You are going to be too big and I don't have enough wire for that. I don't. I really don't have enough wire for that. For this head. Maybe I should use this head.
you are having that belly, this head, and then those feet, really. Yeah, we are playful. Okay, okay, let's let's get playful. Let's get playful. Maybe. Maybe this hand goes better. I don't know. I don't know. And I need a I need a hat. What kind of hat do you want? Also this kind of hat? Or do you want this is to <laughs> are you sure you want this hat? Yes? Okay, cool. So we are going to go with whatever it wants. <laughs> So let's see what <laughs> you are goofy. Goofy. <laughs> you are being a goof. Okay. So this is going to stay on the top of the hat if we can convince. No. No, we cannot convince them. Okay, so let's put your hat on. Let's put your hat on. Okay, so let's see. Let's see how this this is how this is going to work. Let's see how this is going to work. It doesn't work actually. It doesn't because the you see now it is not working. I have to take the Silver wire again. And I'm going to cut this one here and I'm not even measuring it and just eyeballing it. Eyeballing. Yeah, I said that I'm going to go with whatever it wants, so I'm gonna do just that, go with whatever it wants. And I know for sure that it wants that bead, that brown bead. Why do I know that? Because whatever I do, I keep seeing the bead. Even if I'm not looking that way, I keep seeing that bead. So. so I'm gonna grab it and see if now these are going to... You said you wanted this bead. Yes, and now it doesn't fit. I am rummaging through here for a bead to put in their head. Like that. There you go. You are not going to have a bead. Oh, but you need one. Mm -hmm. Let's see if we can find one. Aha! I have found a bead. Let's see if it works. And I don't think that it works. The life of a crafter. Welcome. Welcome to the life of a crafter. 
searching for beads. This one is too big. It works, but it is too big. Okay. It can be your head, but... Like the bead. Is this one smaller? Smaller than that? Yes, it is. A bit smaller. Let's see. Now we are having, we are already having something, but let's see how this one looks. I really don't like it with this big bead up here. No, I don't like it. I don't. Let's see if this red one works. I used these red ones to create the the mushrooms. Yes. Mushrooms. It is not working. It is not working. Whatever. I'm not going to give it nothing. Anything. I'm not going to give it anything in front of her. Over the hat. Okay, so now we are having a hat and a head, and we are going to take these hands out like this, and we are going to give it a sort of kind of. And this is the belly, like that, okay? And then I'm going to put yeah, it is looking nice. And now, now we can take one of these beads and put them here. But, again, the legs are not going to be, it is having, what, what are you doing? Never mind, forget that I asked. But the legs are a little bit too small. The small, the, the legs are too small. <sighs> and I really need a bead in here. Okay, okay. So that I can fix these really well. So they don't, you know. And maybe Maybe we will change the belly. Let's see. Maybe I could give you, maybe I could give you a different belly. Like this one. Hmm? What do you think? And we can have, you know, let's try. Would you like? So that I can put you the shoes. Yes? We'll try. We'll try with this belly. And yes, I am speaking to them. I am. 
yes i'm going to keep you i'm going to keep these only the belly we are going to change the belly so that we can have long beautiful legs and nice shoes yes yes agree agreed so now we are going to have <coughs> Okay, so the legs should be through there. <laughs> you are acting like a child. You are. Yes. Good. There you go. And now I'm going to cut this one. Like that. And I'm going to... I'm going to glue the shoes, but not not yet. For the moment, I want to beat the hands, and the hands are going to be with these white beads, and I'm going to bead whatever wants to be beaded. Nothing. Nothing whatsoever. Okay. So I'll take the beads out. And I am going to bead them. Like that. So, have I found the road to myself yet? <laughs> I don't know. For the moment, I just want to play. I do. And tomorrow we are going to meet again. And tomorrow we are going to make something with paper. Because I'm feeling that my bidding journey is coming to an end really fast. I'm getting, you know. Is this hand long enough? Two more beads. Okay, two more beads. Oh, you do? Okay. Uh, it wants, it wants some, you know, like this. And in here, I'm going to have a. Okay, so these are the hands. You see? I ha it has hands. It does have hands. And I'm going to cut it somewhere here. And then try to, mer to, try to make a perfect loop, but I don't know if I'm going to... If I'm going to make it perfect, but it is going to be a loop. Like that. Okay? And it has a hand. And we are going to make that the other hand. And I'm going to count the beads. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 15. And then this hand. 15 beads. Okay, let's count. And what, what kind of, be of beads? I have four of these. <coughs> One. A. Two. A. Three. And a four. And then I'm having some transparent ones, but I don't know if I can find them because they cannot be seen. Yeah. 
one. I have found one. And I will find the another one. In here. Found it. Found it. Four, six. And then. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine of these. And if the hands are not the same. Well, Come on. I have three more. Okay, and then I will put the sleeve in the hand and the fingers. And then we are going to glue the legs, the, the shoes, and that's it. I will let you... Spend your Sunday in a very, very beautiful way, which is however you want. Do whatever you need to do. Do you need to go dance? Dance. Do you need to sleep? Sleep. Do you need to eat? Eat. Do whatever you want. You just, you little Okay, like that, and it is going to be a little bit I will have to cut a bit Okay, so This is our Fairy. Yes, and now we will have to glue the shoes. We will have to glue the shoes. And wait, what? Are you serious? Oh, I'm going to put A1 and A2. Like that. <clears throat> and this is my intuitive create, creating. This is how I create like an intuitive. I am just listening my first impulse and then follow it. I am paying attention if I'm having impulses and if I do I'm following them. Carefully. Like that. Okay, and then put a little bit of glue here on this. And like that. And glue these together like so and we are having a fairy <laughs> I 
There you go. There she is, but I have to hold her. <coughs> we are having a fairy and an elf. Yes. And the shoes are not really well glued yet, but they are going to be a fairy and an elf. And they look nice together. They do. They really do look nice. They are pretty big, but you know, you can use them to adorn to your uh, purse or to your, I don't know, mirror in the in the car or whatever. But they are nice. They are cute. Yes. So there you have it. This is what we have created today. <laughs> I will see you again tomorrow, guys. Until then, craft with Jay. Bye.